Okay, guys. I'm just recording this for posterity reasons. I just put this necklace on that you can see. It is... I don't know if you can see it. It is small... Well, I'm not sure if that's actually sapphire or not, but I didn't feel anything initially when I put it in my palm. The moment I, I felt a little, maybe a little bit warm sensation. And then the moment I put it on, I just, my temples and my sinuses right here, like everything is just like really heavy. It's hard for me to breathe. It's very, I don't know, I can't keep my eyes open, my eyes are foggy, like it will not let me open my eyes, like I don't know what is going on. I did bring my sage, because I was always paranoid about all the, getting gifts from other people. Oh, it's almost kind of like it feels like it's burning my neck too, that's weird. Um, so what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to take this off, cleanse it in sage, and then see what happens. I mean, it's getting a little bit better now, but, ooh, that's heavy, heavy energy. Like, whew. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it off, and actually I'm going to just do this this way. Because this is actually kind of crazy. This is what happens with me with things. I feel their energy. This is what happened with my other necklace. Oh, my eyes feel like they're burning now. Oh, that is really weird. Oh. Whew. Okay, now that's weird. It no longer being on me, I'm still a little... I can open my eyes now. I can open my eyes. Almost felt like it was burning me when it was like touching me. Um, I gotta figure out where this came from and who it came from. But it's... You can't really see the immediate part of it. But I can actually open up my eyes now. Before I couldn't. That was really weird. So this, this necklace has got some serious energy with it. Um, the fact that I felt like it was burning my throat here when it was touching me. That's really odd too. So I'm going to sage it. But. It's um. I don't know if you can see it here. I'll put it underneath the light. Whew. That's like I. <laughs> That felt really weird, and I'm fine now. I'm better without it being on me. Um, so if you can see this. Oh, it's like... I don't know if you can see that. I need it to be on something that's not going to focus on. Cat! it would focus on it. Is it focus on me? You guys need to get like a decent... Oh, it's not gonna let me. Sorry guys, I'm just trying to fo get have you guys focus on it. Um, I need something that it'll focus on that it won't. There you go, that might be better. My cat's all like, what are you doing? Um, whew, that is just seriously still a little bit jarring there. Ooh, ow, ankle. Ooh. Okay, sitting down now. My leg still hurts from before. Um, 
So let's see if we can do this. You can see the good part there, kind of, but maybe if we could do it that way. I know, I'm just trying to figure out, okay, how I can do this with it not being like super crazy. Because it is a very pretty necklace, it really is. And the problem is it doesn't want to focus because um, Alright. So if I'm out of there right now. I wanted to zoom in. Maybe we can focus on the wall. I mean, it's got sapphires blue. I don't know. It won't let me. I used to be able to zoom in, but because it's facing my way, it's not going to let me. But anyways, it's a little cross. It's got, um, I think it's like sapphires on it. There you go. That's the best I got, guys. zoomed in on it once before but anyways um, now I'm okay I don't know what energy that was Whoop. Um, not sure what energy that was at all but I'll take my sage oil. Also really good for stuff that's going around. Um, take a couple drops in my hand. Another DIY for um, these off. Rub it. And then just see how my eye. And just take the whole entire thing and just rub it. That way it clears the energy of any residual energy from the owner, the previous owner, the person who had it in transit, um, and anything beyond that. So I just wiped it with my palm, and all my see all my hands are I got this age. Wipe down the chain. And we'll see if it actually sage is really good for getting um, the energies to become passive. Now I'm gonna put it on myself as well. Because I have no idea if whatever I had on here before I saged it was an attachment, which um, I would rather not have. Good, bad, or indifferent. Um, I'd rather have good, but it, that was a lot of energy. Um, almost as if when I put my Moldavite on originally. I mean, the fact that I couldn't even open my eyes and you guys saw that, that was, that was pretty crazy. Um, so, there it is again. The necklace and let's see now when I put it on what will happen oh it's saged up Ooh, that's strong all right I release any entity or residual energy from any of the previous owners or the ones in transit only good comes through here only good comes through here only good comes through here white light of Michael. I clear any residual energy that is not of my highest good or for my highest good and dissolve it in the white light of the Holy Spirit. All everything else gets dissolved in the white light of the Holy Spirit. Anything that
that is not of my energy I release back into the universe to return to its sender and if the sender is not on the material plane anymore return it and dissolve it in the white light of the Holy Spirit in Jesus name Amen sorry I have to cleanse it okay let's see what happens now I really did not expect that to happen. <laughs> That's why I didn't sage it first. I still feel a little heady. The energy is still pretty much heavy. But I'm opening my eyes. I don't have a issue with that. I mean, it's actually very pretty. It was given to me as a gift from a family, uh, the aid that my grandmother used to have. Um, probably because she knew Archangel Michael was my angel and these are blue and crosses all equal Archangel Michael. Um, so, let me just sit with it. Yep, pretty much gone. I was going to do that first. I was going to sage it first, but I was like, no, nah, I'll take a chance. And <laughs> dude, that was like being super drugged up. That was the weirdest experience. I mean, I've only had one other experience. I mean, I had an experience like that when I was with that other um, gem that I had. Um, but this being the fact that I couldn't even open my eyes. I don't know exactly what it was supposed to be downloading. I don't know if it was good, bad, or different. But all I know is I didn't really enjoy the feeling of it. So... I'd rather just sage it, get it done and over with, um, to move on. I don't usually have that with certain items. Um, it did come from a lady who's very Catholic, um, very energy, so maybe she blessed it with something, I don't know. But whatever it was that she did or knew of or whatever family it came from, whatever their um, energy was, whatever their beliefs or whatever attachments maybe that was coming with it, um, I no longer need it. That's why it's very good actually to do this. Because um, you don't know, especially if you go to a garage sale, what attachments uh, the spirit or the person who once had it, um, maybe they're still like around or something and they didn't cross over. Um, but I just wanted to document this and this is uh, what was going on and it's good as new now. It's so weird. Even I can't even freaking believe it. I'm going to re-record or play this back to see my eyes and figure out what happened because I wasn't even figuring it out and the fact that my eyes weren't opening that's really weird it was like super like heavy like I felt heavy and usually when you feel heavy like that it's not necessarily a good thing um, at least for me personally I know if I feel heavy it's not necessarily a good thing usually when it's uh, heavy energy it means it's not necessarily for your best interest um, but when it's light energy that means it's like light airy it means it's more of a positive energy and you can work with it more Ow, oh, my ankle still hurts Ugh. Alright guys, I'm going to get going. Um, thank you for bearing with me on this uh, little uh, interesting experiment. <laughs> um, yeah, alright. Love, light, and blessings guys. I gotta do another video to do my other unboxing of that pink thing right there. Which is what I got in the mail. My prosperity bracelets from a friend of mine who does crystals. Um, and she partnered with another girl, Jane, and uh, so much fun. So. Alright, thank you. Love, light, and blessings everybody. Namaste.